What's good, what's good, what's good, YouTube? Um, today is a very slow day for me for various reasons. But I thought I'd vlog it so it wouldn't have to be as lame. First, I gotta chef up the fresh brew. Okay, so now that we got the fresh brew, I'm going to help my friend Ali film his own video. But once that's over, what's the agenda for today? I plan to film a startup rant and then record a podcast for the startup rant, then write an article that's transcribed from the startup rant. Look who it is today, the man. Ali, Ali really wants this lighting so bad that he is going to climb this tree so that he can get the lighting. But Yo, what's up, you? You guys come here. Coming into Ali's room. Damn, Ali, this is a decent setup. And the little bro in there. Tell him how it is, Ines. It's gonna make everything crisp. Fine. Is that all, all you have. have to say? Yep. See? Video's going pretty good. Ali, what do you think? It's going good for the first video. So he's saying that you don't need, even though there's a bunch of expensive ass equipment here basically, he's saying that you don't really need any of this to make a good video. You can just use creativity with angles, lighting, and objects. So now I'm gonna walk you guys through the process of what I do where I take an idea and I turn it into a podcast, an article, and then a YouTube video. What I'm going to be talking about is that you don't need funding to launch your startup. That things like Shark Tank and trying to find capital to run your business is not a given. This isn't something that is an essential part of the process and that a lot of people get this confused. And that once you do get funding that you're trapped in this funding loop. So uh, first I get my ideas out when I write. So I'm going to be writing this article first. Yes, yes. I write my articles on Medium. You can catch me on Medium at Matt LF Smith. I want to make my drafts first, yes, yes. We're about to go see Mirza now, who, if you saw the very first episode of Hustle Guru, I need to be on this Guru show. <laughs> I, I started working on Blanket with Ali Kolai. Mirza made blanket and he's coding at some Starbucks or something right now. We're about to go check in on his progress. There's a lot of content out there, like a lot of comedians, a lot of vloggers. How do you get discovered? Um, they're trying to make it easier if you're making quality content to get that initial traction through blanket. Mirza, the Mirza. What's going on? Uh, finalizing the app. How's the development going? Intense. Intense. Yeah. Oh boy. Say more. Oh, I have like literally less than a week to publish this shit. Do you have a preview of the app? Well, you gotta wait. You know, until <laughs> it's on the app store. You gotta. So when is it? By the end of this week? And yeah. And hopefully. Week. Two days. Literally have two days to publish this. All right, Mirza. See you later. So now I just gotta go home and record the podcast startup rant video based on the podcast and the article that I wrote. And I gotta edit this video that I'm filming right now. I was about to go home, but Ali told me that he had to drop something off. He brought some equipment from someone all the way in the suburbs. And so he was like, you want to come along? And I was like, sure. So oh, how shit. did you meet this person and what did you borrow from them? I borrowed an Osmo from DJI. What's an Osmo? This is not sponsored, by the way. It is a whole stabilizer that lets you get not shaky footage. Oh, so you pu pu put your you phone know. into this? You put your phone into it, you turn it on, it stabilizes the... So it means nothing. So then it's kind of... The logic behind it, I mean, as a person you are... I mean, you are a person, but actually you are nothing. But when you acknowledge that you are nothing, then you connect with everything. Mm. See you guys.
Thanks for the ride, bro. You're welcome, bro. It's a nice talk, bro. Yes, yes. Now that I am home, I still have the podcast and the actual video for the Startup Rant to film. So what I do is I just use the iMovie video editing software that I normally use and then I take this Audio-Technica AT2020. It's pretty good actually. Um, it was about a hundred bucks. I got it for 99 and it's really good sound quality. If you're looking for a holiday gift or something like that, I would definitely recommend this. So yeah, I just take a, a, the, I use the video editing software, I record a long voiceover, and then I export it as an mp3. What's going on guys, this is Hustle Guru. Today I'm going to be talking about why venture funding is overrated. And then this little area right here is where I usually film the videos. I'm probably just going to film it like this, sitting here, da 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 And... Yeah, that's about it. That was my day. See you guys next time.